Hello everybody and welcome to another episode on my channel. My name is Owen Jenkins and I'll be running through my pipeline to camera project images in Blender using Blender and another program called FSpy. So I'm just going to get into it. Normally I would take my own pictures of the architecture or things that I'd be modeling but I just went on to Pixabay today because they have easy royalty free images that you can use. And so I just went up there and I found an architectural image that I liked. I found a render of a a tunnel that was rounded that I, I liked, so I downloaded that. And then after downloading it, then I imported it into FSpy, which is a program that calculates your photo's focal length so that you can camera project it in Blender, or you can export it as a JSON file to use in other programs. So I just lined up those um, X and Y axis so that the 3D plane would be correct, and then I imported it into Blender and once you got it loaded then you just um, put in a camera and then I aligned a plane and I made sure the plane aligned up with the sides and I extruded it up forwards and backwards I won't get into the entire thing because this is a tutorial but then I added a cylinder and then I extruded it over the entire picture and then I extruded out the door I projected it by using the UV project modifier then I went and selected it and made another camera and then I animated it and then put it in a sphere so that you could tell that there are 3D objects that are interacting with the 3D environment now. Last thing I did was I put the image texture to a color ramp into the normal and the roughness nodes so that it would give it some texture. And then I'll go ahead and render it and this is what it should look like. So yeah, there you have it. I also took a few photos from Google just to experiment in practice. And this one turned out really good. I liked the way that it was. It showed how you can relight your scenes and make pretty significant changes to your pictures and you can use them to your full advantage. So that's, that's it for me today. Bye.